Hello, this is a short video tutorial on how to change your preferences to avoid promotional sales emails from Artsonia. While many people do enjoy purchasing items that features their child's artwork, um, one of the parents was upset because I had no idea that you'd be getting um, emails daily. He was getting two or three emails daily requesting that he purchase items. Um, this is not the reason that Foster Elementary School has joined Artsonia. While we wanted to allow you to purchase items if you wanted to, since this has been successful in the past, the, the artwork is up there for us all to enjoy, for the interaction we've been having with people um, leaving notes for children about their email, um, having the children write about, excuse me, about their artwork, having children write about their artwork. It's been wonderful. However, I do want you to understand how you can um, change your profile to avoid those promotional sales emails if you don't want to receive them. First of all, you're going to make sure you go to artsonia.com. Then you're going to look for this blue button over here that says login. You also could click parents and then go through another page, but it's a little more quick to go to login. You're going to log in under parent. Now, in Artsonia Parents, you have originally gave your um, permission with a specific email address. You should use that email address, and you should have a password from the first time that you logged in. You had your child's key, and you used that to log in, and they asked you to create a password. If you have not gone through that step, then you would not be receiving the emails. So, But if you cannot receive, if you cannot um, remember your password, just go down here and you can click to recover your email address you used or your password. You'll come to this page once you've logged in. Now, you will want to at times review comments left about your child's art or help edit the fan club or you can even upload new artwork and review past artwork. But today we're talking mostly about options for parents you're going to want to edit my profile. So click this top um, text, please. You'll come to this page and you'll see all of your information that you can change. You want to scroll down and when you scroll down at the bottom you're going to see information regarding your email options. If you've been receiving email this will have been checked on for promotions and you'll receive those promotional emails and if you want those leave that clicked on. If you don't, just click it off. I recommend highly that you leave artist activity on because you'll receive automatic notification when your child has art published. I also recommend you keep news and announcements on. I'll be sending some um, occasional email every two weeks or so about things happening in the art room. At least that's the plan right now. If you don't want to receive those emails, click that off. Then make sure you click continue. Um, it doesn't say save, but this is how you save if you click continue. After you've clicked continue, you'll come back to this page, and then you want to log out right here. And that's how to change your email preferences. I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions that have not been answered, please email me at cmckeon, M-C-K-E-O-N, at hinghamschools.org. Bye-bye.